And obviously, I won't be able to use all this stuff. I'll just pick whatever come, whatever you know is good. Uh, this is actually one of the songs on the record that was written on acoustic guitar initially, and I think that's I like to write an acoustic sometimes because you can hear everything so clearly. And with a with an electric guitar, it's easy to just put on the distortion and just you know plow through those power chords. But uh, so with this one, I was able to find a lot of open chords and a lot of different chord forms. I think that are interesting. Uh, to listen to. This is a song that was written based initially on a poem that my sister had written and shared with me and wanted to know if I could do anything with it. Um, and so there are some of her lines and ideas in the song. Where it ended up was, you know, I kind of, again, I put it through my filter and put my own spin on it. The theme maybe changed a little bit. There, there's a theme of just kind of being in a place where you feel like you are at the end of your energy, you're, you're um, in a place of maybe being overwhelmed uh, and you need a breakthrough and you know that you need um, grace, you know that you need to be able to find time to pray and find center uh, in yourself, but you know, life has a way of not wanting you to let that happen for you. Um, and so I feel like patience is kind of that prayer that you throw up in that moment, just, hey, God, I need help. And the hope there, of course, that is gonna come through. And so, I, so it's a very hopeful song. And I, I felt like it needed to be near the end of the record, uh, even though it's a, you know, a upbeat song. And um, musically, it does some things that we haven't done in other songs. It has the, like, the slow down section and, um, I, it could have been, I think, a good, maybe, um, it could have been up front, but I wanted it to be near the end because I wanted to introduce that element of hope um, towards the end especially and to come out of some of the darkness that was in the lyrics. Why two patients? I always wondered this. Why, why not just one patient? <laughs> Uh, it's just better that way. <laughs> Twice the patient. <laughs> it's comma, so it's like you get, patience, you get to so use a comma, yeah. Patience. I don't even have the patience to say both of them. No. <laughs> Well, I mean, obviously, we, we abbreviate everything. We should just, the next album should just be, every song should be a one-word title, because mm -hmm. that's what they end up being. One thing I've been told a lot about the song is a lot of people say it reminds them of Panic at the Disco, but better. How do you feel about that? Uh, I'm glad they think it's better. Uh, it was, it's another one of those things where if you revealed your actual influences, nobody would ever guess, usually. Uh, most people, when they guess, where they say, oh, this song sounds like this person or that person or this song, that it's not really, that wasn't really the inspiration for the song. But of course, there are artists that I've stolen from, and I'm not going to tell you who they are because then you'd be like, oh, yeah, you stole that from them. <laughs> <laughs> and the recording, this ended up being one of the most vocally focused songs. And on the album, we ended up doing a lot of falsetto, and I feel like a lot of songs ended up having that element to it. Um, and so this has some falsetto sections, and it has. Um, just a lot of different harmonies and stuff that were kind of thrown in. It's one of the last things we did, Ryan and I were just in his bedroom actually because the power in the studio was out and I was just recording basically whatever I came up with in terms of background vocals, but I think it ended up being kind of interesting and dynamic. Uh, so a lot of, uh, I've always liked overlapping vocal parts. Um, mm. So it's glad we got to do some more of those on this song and on this album. Stuck in a world that's spinning, I need to get back to would you agree that you have to have high, high hopes for a living? Yes. <laughs> 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 <laughs>